This workout plan is the hardest thing I have ever done in my life and I wouldn't want to repeat it. I wouldn't want to repeat it, but you have to. <laughs> the first two years of my four year fitness journey, I trained at home and I learned valuable lessons there, more valuable than the lessons I learned in the gym. And I always asked myself, I'm not building muscle. My parents don't, my, my parents don't let me go to the gym. What is even good about training at home? And how can I maximize my training effort and my, my training gains that I make from training at home without needing to buy expensive equipment or pay for some fucking coach to tell me? And this is why this video is provided to you freely and you only need some dumbbells, which are sold for like 20 bucks on Amazon and a pull-up bar, which is also sold for maybe 15 bucks. I've been training with a pull-up bar from Amazon that literally costs like 10 bucks. I will link it in the description um, for like said two years and it never broke down and I'm honestly very satisfied with it. I'll also link everything that I referred to in this video in the description. So if you just want to buy the gear, the gear that I bought back then. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. <laughs> this is gonna get clipped. Um, or you want to do the workouts that I will be referring to in this video, you can also head down into the description and simply do them. Now, there are two things I want to highlight before we dive into this, because without this, people will say these training things, the, the, the training routine that I'm putting together for you is useless. The first thing is we're not trying to build muscle here. Okay. Training at home and you need to face this truth. I needed to face this truth too. I'm not, I don't accept, I don't expect you to accept it instantly, but it's just the thing everyone who trains from home needs to realize. You don't train at home for gains, not for immediate gains. What you train at home for is mental tenacity, which I will talk about in a second, and muscle control, which I will also talk about in the second point. So we're not building this training program for people who want to build muscle from home. So I kind of lied to you in the title. But also not, because let me tell you one thing. The people who used to tell me, how much do you bench, bro? How much do you squat, bro? Knowing exactly that I didn't have a squad rack at home and that I fucking cried myself to sleep because I didn't, because I wasn't allowed to go to the gym. Those people are now the same people who tell me, what are you taking, bro? You're taking something, you must be taking something. That, th those are the same kinds of people, right? The people who wanted to pull me down back then, they're trying to pull me down now. So haters are going to hate. And I wanted to escape from that. And I always used to click on videos like this. And they used to always tell me, build muscle. Mm. And I thought to myself, you motherfucker, I know what you're going to tell me. Train as heavy as possible with three sets. Mm. And I didn't build muscle from that. There was one point in this two year period where I thought, fuck the, all these YouTubers, fuck every single one of them. I'm going to do my own workouts. I'm going to combine theirs together so may, they make a good workout for me. And that's exactly what I'm about to share with you today, because this is the way I used to train for, for literally like a whole year, right? One year I was wandering around, clicking on videos like this, hoping, begging for them to give me the way to train, to give me the secret sauce that they seemed to have. And I'm not gonna lie to you, now I go to the gym. This physique that I have is not possible to build only from home, but it's also not possible to build this kind of physique without having trained at home. Which brings me to the second and third point, which is mental toughness and muscle control. Muscle control and mental tenacity are the only things you really gain from trading at home. And of course, your wallet doesn't suffer as much or the wallet of your parents if you're under age, if you're underage, which you probably are. 
Now, you build muscle control because at home, you need to understand how your muscles work. If you just do the movement at home, you're gonna lose and you're not gonna build muscle or muscle control or mental tenacity. You need to do a bunch and a bunch of fucking reps, which this workout is gonna be directed at, to be able to gain muscle control. And you will always see the people who trained at home in the gym who have a very smooth form in their, in their workouts who press in such a satisfying way and it looks so good and it feels better for them. They're less prone to injury because those protector, those protector muscles that are around your shoulder, that are in your shoulder joints, they are built up by training from home, by doing a lot of reps that of course not all go on the target main muscle. That's muscle control. You will definitely build that because at home you need to understand how muscles work, in which direction they pull, how you need to position your feet, how you need to position your body, how you can maybe train bicep with your own body weight, which is pretty difficult to do, which is why dumbbells and a pull-up bar are the only two things you really need because you can't really train pull heavy at home without using weights or a pull-up bar. Now, muscle control makes you less prone to injury and more prone to building muscle because your form is gonna be way better, trust me. The worst form I've ever had is still better than the form of most people who were in the gym the equal amount of time than me. Because I have this, this feeling, okay, I sort of know that I need to stretch the muscle out and then pull it together and, ad and add weight to that movement that contracts the muscle. And that is body, that, that is body control. This is this romanticized thing of I want to gain body control. The only way you gain body control is by training with your body and not with weights. Now mental tenacity. The workout I'm gonna tell you today is the kind of workout that makes people quit and that tells you what you're made of. If you can pull through a year or more of this, trust me, you are gonna get everything in life you want. You want to lose weight, fine. You want to add weight, fine. You wanna bulk, cool. You wanna go to 10 out of 10 intensity in every single workout, cool, you can do it. The first day in the workout, and we're gonna start right in, is gonna be legs. And for legs, you're gonna do 13 reps, so one hour in general of the five minute leg workout that I've put in the description. It's a workout by a German guy called Sascha Huber, and most people aren't gonna understand him, but you are gonna see the exercises and know what he means. You're gonna understand what he wants you to do, and you're gonna do exactly that. I'm gonna instruct you, however, to on the last exercise, which is calf raises, do a low squat hold. So you just go into a low squat and then hold it, right? A squat hold to just do that instead of the calf raises. So that's for Monday. For Tuesday, and of course, like no set pauses, right? You just get the workout done, get up, re replay the whole video and do that 13 times. 13, not 30. So for one hour straight, you're gonna do this workout. Then on Tuesday with chest, you're gonna do dips for one hour straight. That's it. <laughs> You're gonna do dips for one hour straight. And if you want to beat my record, I did 600 dips in one hour, which is an average of 10 dips per minute, which is gonna be hard, trust me. At some point, it's gonna be hard. And by the way, single reps don't count. So you can't do one rep, you can either do two reps or zero reps because one rep could be just you jumping up and then doing the negative, and that's of course not uh, one real dip. So one rep doesn't count, only up from two reps counts. So that's about 10 a minute. On Wednesday, you're gonna do pull-ups. And I also did 600 pull-ups in one hour. 600 pull-ups in one hour is doable if you can, again, do 10 pull-ups a minute. 
Again, same rule as with the dips and same rule for all, um, for all the exercises that I'm doing here or that I'm telling you to do. One rep doesn't count. Only two reps count. Now for Thursday, which is gonna be pull-up day. Uh, not, not a pull-up day, I'm sorry. Which is gonna be arm day. And for arm day, you're gonna do the five minute arm workout by the same guy. It's the best pump you will probably ever have in your entire life. This is the workout that got me started onto my fitness journey. Without that workout, I wouldn't have started. The pump felt so amazing and I remember grabbing my phone and it never felt so light and that's just the thing that got me addicted, right? I love picking up things and they have a different weight, a lighter weight than I expected them to have. And that's exactly what my phone had back then after doing this workout. And that's what got me hooked. And that's why you're watching this video right now. Because without this video that I've linked in the description, I wouldn't be where I am right now. I would probably be a Jeffrey. And you're gonna do this again 13 times without pause. And you're just gonna try and just bowl your way through it. You can lower the weight. In fact, you should lower the weight. Uh, the highest I've ever, I was ever able to do this workout with for one hour is 5 kg. Okay? So don't do the workout with more than 5 kg if you're a beginner. You can use just the, the barbell if you want to or the, or the dumbbell grips if you have dumbbells that are adjustable. Or just use a very light weight, but you don't need more than 5 kg for this. Then, on Friday, you're going to do push-ups. And you're going to think, hold up, isn't that just a second chest day? Actually not. In my personal experience with push-ups, push-ups aren't really for your chest if you do them correct or if you do them in the way that I do them, which is pretty much here, being here, and then pushing up. Of course, you can manipulate them into being for your chest, but mainly push-ups in the way I do them are tricep oriented. Now, if you realize, okay, I still have a sore chest on Friday, which can be the case, you can just move that to Saturday or Sunday and take a rest day on Friday. Now, on Saturday, we either have this push-up day that you didn't do because you had a sore chest on Friday, or we have another leg day. <laughs> now, you can move these workouts around and you're going to realize, okay, if I do the leg day on Saturday, I'm not going to be able to do it on Monday again. And this is the key for this workout program. This is the way you start, right? This is only... The, the things you can do, and this is the order I had it put in. However, you can manipulate this to your will. You can say, okay, today I have a feeling I want to train arms. And then you go and train arms with the training regimen that you usually would go through on, I think it was Wednesday or Thursday. And just do that on any other day. You can manipulate this workout program to your will and just train the muscles that aren't sore on the days you want to train them. Now you might have realized that we are entering high, high, high volume. And as I told you, this workout isn't for the people who want to bulk and put on muscle and do fucking bodybuilder from home. That's not gonna happen, trust me. The biggest you will ever get in your home gym is the leanest you will ever be when you're in the gym. Just a little proverb for you. Because at home, you have to do a lot of reps in general if you don't have a fucking home gym, which most of you probably don't have, to get the intensity in that you need to tear open those muscle strings. And I know that many people are going to say this workout routine is shit. And many people are going to say, oh, it doesn't work, it doesn't build muscle. You have to listen. You have to listen to me. Because this workout isn't made for people who want to build muscle right now. It's made for the people who want to access their 100% as soon as they lay a foot into the gym. This workout isn't going to build muscle for you right now. But I promise it is going to increase the capacity you have to build muscle in the gym later on. Um, 
by every single day. So every single work that you do at home will increase the way of understanding you have for training and for fitness in general, and therefore help you build more muscle in the future. So this is actually um, a video where the title is in clickbait, how to build more muscle from home on a budget. <laughs> uh, that's the title of this video probably going to be. And that is exactly what I'm telling you right here. You're going to build more muscle in the future, not now, but you're going to build more muscle in the future from home on a budget as a beginner. So I fulfilled my promise and didn't just copyright you. If you like this sort of forest style videos, I'm always recording in the forest. You can subscribe to my channel and get daily video updates, right? Daily, fucking daily. I think that my channel is very valuable and I hope that this video provided some value to you. If it did, you can go praise me in the comments. If it didn't, you can go write a hate comment to me and fucking tell me that you will kill my family, whatever. If you want a certain video topic to be explored or explained by me, you can simply write a comment and request that video. If you have a question about self-improvement or training in general, you can go to the comments, blah, 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 blah. Okay, what I'm basically telling you here is give me some engagement, give me some views, boost this video for the YouTube algorithm because I'm a needy little YouTuber, right? I don't even have money for sleeves, right? I have to wear a sleeveless in the cold fucking forest. <laughs> Not sure if I'll put this in, by the way. <laughs> now have a nice day. Master your mind and do a hard fucking workout for Jesus Christ. Do some reps for Jesus.